We're here at Wicket 2012 in Dubai in the United Arab Emirates. And I'm very pleased to be joined by Jefferson Fouad Nassif, who is Head of International Affairs for Anatel. Mr. Nassif, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Welcome. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'd like to start off by asking you about your impressions of Wicket 12 so far. Well, my impressions are very good. Though the negotiations are very hard, of course, it's an international treaty and couldn't be uh, on the contrary. Uh, but uh, our expectations, uh, the expectations from Brazil are very high and uh, I think that we can get really good results from this conference. That's what our region and Brazil really wish. What are the major concerns for you in terms of uh, telecommunications in your region? Well, in terms of concerns for telecommunications in Brazil and in our regions, we have many. Of course, I, I, I couldn't list all of that for you right now where I can say that uh, our major concerns can, can be summarized by two or three. Um, for instance, uh, taxes. As you know, taxes, it's quite burden for our telecommunication services. And then for Brazil particularly, uh, we are willing to, uh, to have this provision in the article so that we can pay uh, less um, taxes for, for our customers. And all the very important thing is the, uh, the, uh, what we call hubs or uh, not IXPs, because we are not dealing with uh, internet here, but it's a kind of uh, uh, exchange points, traffic exchange points, so that we can, um, by these regional hubs, uh, create more traffic, and then we could, uh, what we envisage, it's to, to, to pay less or even nothing for, uh, for, for this traffic uh, carriers, for this traffic management, and then we could also and again, our, as, we are, as we are trying to, of course, bring more services and better and cheaper prices for users, uh, this kind of regional hub would be very important for them to, de to, to decrease prices for them. And what do you see as being the most positive aspects of Wicked 12? The most positive uh, aspect for us is, of course, being here to discuss. Uh, the international telecommunication sector has changed a lot. Uh, from uh, 1988, uh, we had a, a state-owned, almost a state-owned uh, sector at that time, and then in the 90s, the, the scenario has changed, and, and then, uh, of course, it was needed to revise it and put now on the ITRs new provisions, the provisions that could um, actually um, uh, insert uh, things that are really important for the sector such as this, this kind of thing that I said, um, uh, uh, traffic management, um, hubs, uh, questions related to, to roaming, which are very important for many regions, and Europe has been done an extremely important uh, job in this regard. And finally, what are the outcomes that you hope to see come from Wicked 12? Well, first uh, I would like to have an outcome. It's very important to have an outcome. Uh, be, having uh, an ITR revised with new provisions are extremely important. This is the most important thing that we have at this moment in time in the negotiations. And, uh, and new questions regarding uh, the traffic management is of course uh, extremely important. And then we could have uh, also important to have different visions uh, inside, the, uh, inside the ITRs. That's really important so that all regions can can, can be reflected, the concerns of our regions can be reflected in the ITRs. That's the most important thing. Jefferson Fuentes, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you, Max.